Hello you lovely lot and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here my name is Massa and I'm an all-around creative who's very much sick of the struggling artist narrative so I'm on a mission to live my best life while still being a creative to prove that you can actually do that. So if that sounds like your kind of thing or something you might enjoy then hit the subscribe button and come along for the ride. So I originally started filming this video I think a little while ago I ended up having to push back the product launch that I was planning for the 30th of June. I had to push it back a week so it's gonna go up on the 7th of July. With any luck this video will also be going up on the 7th of July but we'll see about that. So there's some clips in here that are older clips but they're my genuine reactions to some things so I'm gonna still put them in here. So if you've been here a little while then you'll know that I'm planning a business pivot possibly away from home fragrance, unsure yet, but in order to minimize the amount of loss that I'm going to make, I am doing a product launch so that I can use up some of the raw materials that I already have so that I end up making less of a loss, essentially. So that's why we're doing the product launch. Some of the oils are oils that I already owned. I have ordered in some new oils, but just like very small amounts of them so that I can use them in one go and not have oils left over because as we know, I like to order too much of things and have them lie around. So here is a clip of me unboxing or opening up some of the new oils that I got, which are all so amazing, but he is past Massa with those oils. Okay, so I had absolutely no intention at all whatsoever of filming today, but guess what came in the post? I can already smell them through the bag and they smell amazing. I know I said I wasn't gonna get any more oils because I wanted to use up the oils that I already had for this like product drop that I'm doing, which is yes, absolutely facts. However, I am also going to be doing the soft launch of some bookish things, which I'm so excited about. I've been talking about doing bookish products for literally ever, so we're finally doing it. So I've got some oils for that. Aha, it's a bag within a bag. I think I can already smell one of them, which is so exciting because I've heard nothing but good things about this oil and I'm just so bloody excited to try it. I think I got, I can't even remember what I got to be honest. It's this one I can smell, I know it is. Oh my god. Cappuccino truffle is this one. And it is so good. I can already smell it. Oh my god. So it's like like dark roast coffee, but also you get that sweetness coming through and you've got just like the tiniest, tiniest little hint of vanilla coming through. And it's perfect. It's like the perfect chocolate coffee smell, but it's more like, I would say it's predominantly coffee smell. It's just, oh, it's so good. That's gonna be one of the bookish ones. What else have we got in the bag? <laughs> I'm excited about this one. This one's also gonna be in the standard collection. I kind of like didn't listen to my own advice or take my own word for things. So I did buy a tiny little oil for the normal stuff that's gonna come out. Ooh. Okay, so this one's lemongrass and ginger. It's not as punchy as I thought it would be, but also it's lemongrass and not lemon, so that is fine. It's a nice mellow citrusy note. You're getting like other citruses in there and like it's just really warming like the, from the ginger. So, oh, that one's really good. And then we have this one which I'm so bloody excited about, even though I'm pretty sure I've decided that the bookish thing I was going to make with this scent is now going to be in like the next phase of bookish things. So um, I'm pretty sure that's going to be in like phase two of bookish launches. So, but still like I'm excited to smell it. Oh, I didn't know what it was going to smell like. And this is, 
I don't know how to explain it other than it reminds me of my dad. <laughs> I don't know how that makes sense. So this is supposed to be, this one's called Afternoon Tea and it's like Earl Grey and that kind of vibes. So it's like a very subtle, gorgeous smelling one. I'm interested to see how this is going to perform in an actual wax and see what it comes out like in wax melts and then try candles with it also. But I am so bloody excited. They all smell so, so good. It just smells freaking incredible. Like, but I'm so excited to get creating and get making with those. Oh my goodness. I do have to wait until whatever this weird heat wave that the UK is having has disappeared because it's so hot already that there's absolutely no way I'm going to be standing over a stove, like melting wax and doing anything like that at all whatsoever. So hopefully there isn't too much of a gap between when this is filmed and the rest of the video, but we'll see. Back to future me! That was so weird. Thanks past massa. So I have made a bunch of the wax melts. There's a little bit more of them that I need to make. The bookish ones I haven't made yet. I'm honestly not sure if the stickers are actually going to get here before the launch, so I might have to push that back or do like a separate like mini bookish launch, I guess. But a lot of the stuff that I've made, I sold a bunch of them because I also did a market last week, but that's besides the point. So we're going to make some more products today. Tomorrow is launch day from like where I'm filming right now. Tomorrow is the 7th and tomorrow is launch day. I feel like I'm in a good place. I do still have all my photography left to do, which as we know is the bane of my life. I need to figure out how to do better photography. I'm just not sure how to do it yet. So I think that might be a tomorrow job, but I'm also dog sitting tomorrow. So who knows how that's going to go. So I might try and set up how I want the actual images to look. So I can sort of like plan out what I want to do with them so that when tomorrow rolls around and there's like very nice daylight, then I can quickly take the pictures and have them uploaded. I am going to take the website offline tomorrow morning so I can have everything set up and ready to go for 7pm. So that's the plan. I need to go and make some more wax melts so that everything can be ready and then we'll do some stickering and basically try and get this launch set up and ready to go. We, we watch the sun go down over the same old town Like so many times before we look at the same old stars Battle the same old wars like so many times before
last of the wax melts I had to make which is so exciting so I think I am going to do the bookish launch as like a separate little launch just because I was only going to do it with like it was meant to be like a soft launch of the bookish stuff sort of so it was only going to be like two or three bookish melts anyway so I think I'm just gonna leave that for another time and maybe do like five or six of them at the same time and see how that goes. Just waiting for the wax melts to set, having a little think about what photography sort of thing I want to do. I might have a quick look online on like Etsy and places like that to see what other people are sort of doing to try and get some inspiration, maybe look on Pinterest and then I think I will do the stickering and then figure out the photography so that we're all ready to go for tomorrow. Basically, that's the end of the updates for today, I believe. I'll see you in the morning. Good morning. I'm having to whisper a little bit because it is, well, to be fair, it's like 20 to 8 at this point and my partner's still asleep, but we are awake. We have our coffee in the most perfect mug. You see that? It says I'm not a morning person on it. It's very accurate for someone that had to wake up at 10 to 7, but I had to wake up early, not because it's launch day, which it is and we're very excited for, but because I have a little companion helper with me for the day. So, dog sitting by myself for the first time ever and um, I've never looked after a dog for a full day by myself before so I'm excited I'm nervous a bit scared that it's lining up with launch day but that's besides the point so I'm gonna have my coffee but the main thing is I am about to take the website offline and have it password protected so that I can just do bits of it throughout the day and um, make sure that it's all like set and good and ready to go and then put it back live at seven o'clock tonight which is when the whole shebang kicks off in theory so I'm just gonna how did I even do this it's been a while so I don't fully remember how to take it offline and have it password protected so just like bear with me a second Website is done, and now I just need to take this little girl on a or one of these so that she will chill out. No, you're gone in the morning, but I'll be okay if you stay. Stay. No, you're gone in the morning, but I'll be okay if you stay. It's been so manic this entire day and we're just putting it live now. So hopefully it looks nice. I should probably do a post about it, but I don't anticipate that I will get any sales essentially because that's just generally how my things go, not being pessimistic, not manifesting negativity or whatever but that's just generally how they go i am putting the final touches on while we launch but website is alive and there is not a single soul on there so I'll check back in tomorrow morning in case anything drastic happens. Hello, so I'm realising that I never updated after that, so I haven't wrapped up this video, but it is a little while after the launch and shock, no sales. But we are trying and we do have a market coming up tomorrow and they usually go okay-ish, 
and we get sales so that'll be nice but thank you so much for watching this video if you liked it give it a big old thumbs up if you want more videos like this and you like watching videos like this then do hit the subscribe button we are so close to 500 and it would be an absolute dream come true to actually hit 500 because as you know my aim is to get monetized so it would be a really nice surprise to actually get to the halfway point finally thanks again for watching the video if you wanted to support me and support this channel all my social media links are down below the link to my website is down below along with a cheeky little discount code and if you wanted to buy me a coffee to keep me going all that is linked down below as well so thanks again for watching and i will see you guys soon for another video bye